All right, so we're here with Ellen Port, um, Curtis Cup captain for 2014. 14, sorry. And um, so we were just catching up with her here at the um, Missouri Women's Golf Association event today at uh, Old Kinderhook and um, thought we'd get uh, maybe an update on how things are going with the Curtis Cup. Well, that's great. Yeah, things are heating up. Um, for those of you who don't know, uh, the Curtis Cup is uh, the biennial competition between the women, best women USA players in Great Britain, Northern Ireland, and Scotland. And we're, 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 it's based on how you play in t uh, the last two years with the emphasis on this summer. So things are heating up. We've had a couple gals emerge as really – uh, NCAA champion Annie Park, some USC players, some top collegiate players. Uh, we've had a couple seniors in high school that are soon to be freshmen win two of the summer events. And it's really getting exciting to see everybody raise their game up a notch. And the selection is going to take place after the January uh, uh, tournaments. There's three tournaments in January, and the selection will take place in January. Uh, for the uh, 2014 Curtis Cup, uh, which is going to be in St. Louis Country Club. And uh, we're trying to, our, my goal I, as far as galleries is uh, overseas, they have six, seven, eight thousand people. When it's over on our soil at the women's, we only usually have two or three thousand. So everybody, just come on out, mark it on your calendars, and let's cheer the American girls on. Right. And so when when uh, when it comes around, uh, what's what's the date on it for 2014? It's June, I believe, 5th, 6th, and 7th. It's the first Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Okay. It's either 5th, 6th, 7th, or 6th, 7th, 8th. I think it's 5th, 6th, yeah. 7th. And it's a three-day event, foursomes, uh, four ball, and singles matches. I mean, as far as amateur golf goes for, for women, this is this is as Big well, it really is. An event. This is. Yeah, this has been going on since 1932, and it's just something all amateur golfers strive for. It's one of there's a lot of really good players that just because of the timing of them nowadays turning professional, that don't get on the team, but it's on the radar screen of the top junior players and top female. Even there's some mid ams that are working hard on their game as well, and it's it's a great competition, um, and it was the highlight of my career. I know. So old Kinderhood, quite a facility, huh? Yeah, this oh, it's is great. I've never been down here. Yeah. I don't get to. I really tell everybody I don't play very much golf. You know, yeah. well, I haven't had a hole in one ever because I'm not lucky and I don't play enough, <laughs> enough golf. But I've heard a lot about Portachima and old Kinderhood. But I'll be coming back here. <laughs> awesome. All right. Well, we appreciate your time. All right. Thank Thanks. you so much. All right. Randy.